Hello friends, welcome to my channel Maths Ma'am. Today in this video, we are going to start a new chapter of class 9 and class 10 that is linear equation in two variables. In this video, we are going to do the introduction part of the linear equation in two variables. Before starting the linear equation in two variables, we should know what is a linear equation in one variable. One variable means either in x or in y or z, any variable. Here in this, we can represent linear equation in one variable as ax plus b is equal to 0. Here a is a coefficient of x and b is a constant term and x is a variable here. So, if we have to find the value of x from here, we can move the constant term to the right side and we can easily find the value of x like this. So, x is equal to minus b by a. Only one value of x possible in one variable right for example if we take an example like 7x plus 14 is equal to 0 this is an equation in one variable and variable is x here right and we have to find the value of x how we can find we can move this 14 to the right side or we can add and subtract both the sides minus 15 minus 14 both the side we subtract minus 14 we can cancel from the left side and we have as x is equal to minus 2 what it means that x can have only one value that is minus 2 which will give us 7x plus 14 is equal to 0 as if we put here x uh, 2 minus 2 in place of x what we will get minus 14 plus 2 plus 14 will get cancelled and we'll get as answer 0 so only for only one value of x this equation is true right this is linear equation in one variable and so we can conclude that a linear equation has only one or unique solution. Okay, this is a part for the linear equation in one variable. Now we'll do the linear equation in two variables. What it means here we have two variables x and y. And a and b are the coefficients of x and b, y respectively and c is a constant term. Right, here we have to find the value of x as well as value of y. And we can represent this as a on the axis like x axis like this and y. So if we make a line like this, if we make the equation, the line will come the line equation will be in this form ax plus b plus y c is equal to zero. Right. How is it is possible? We'll explain this by taking an example. Like for for example, we have an equation 4x plus 2y is equal to 12. This is a linear equation in two variables that is x and y. So we how come we know that uh, how many possible values are there for x and y for that what we'll do we'll make a table and we'll start putting different different values of x and y okay suppose let's start with 0 if we put the value of x as 0 then if x is equal to 0 then y would be how much for like this we'll solve by putting the value of x as 0 is equal to 12 then y is equal to 6 right now if we have y 0 then what will happen then we put y as 0 in this equation and we'll find as x is equal to 3 right now if we have 1 x is equal to 1 then y would be how much if x is equal to 1 then we can find 4 times 1 plus 2y is equal to 12 and 2y is equal to 8 and then a y would be equal to 4. Next if we have x is equal to 2 like this we can put any number of values. Suppose x is equal to 2 then y would be how much? 4 times 2 plus 2y is equal to 12. So 8 and 2y is equal to 4 and y would be equal to 2 like this we'll make a table for this right like this and now we can put more values if you can put like minus 2 if we put what we have if x is equal to minus 2 then it would be 4 times minus 2 plus 2y is equal to 12 then it will become 2y is equal to 20 and y would be equal to 10 right like this now we have made a table and now we'll show how we can represent this equation in the form of x-axis and y-axis. 
so if we put here the all the values like if here we can see that 3 0 means here x value is 3 and y is 0 and 0 6 means we'll plot the equation like this in the form of x and y axis like this and then we get to know how we can make this so this is a, a line this is a graph representing the line uh, line for x plus 2 y is equal to 12 thank you for watching my video and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel so that you get notified whenever i put my next video